You may have heard of the Rotap RX29, but what about the RX29e Premium? What is it? Is it better than the standard Rotap? Don't worry, I'll tell you everything you need to know, so stick around. Hi, I'm Candice, and technology has started playing a bigger role in getting dependable sieve analysis results. And because of that, devices designed to automate the test sieve analysis process and minimize user error, like the Rotap ePremium sieve shaker, were created. And here at WS Tyler, we understand how critical integrating the right equipment is when developing an operation that produces optimal particle analysis results. This is why we leverage our 150 years of experience to help customers navigate the variety of options available to them. So in this video, we'll go over what a Rotap RX29e Premium is, how the RX29e Premium works, what test sieves can be used with the device, the initial setup that you can expect, common maintenance to look out for, and how much the Rotap RX29e Premium costs. The Rotap RX29e Premium is an electromagnetic sieve shaker designed to give lab technicians complete control of how material is tested. This level of control is granted through the device's control panel, which allows users to operate within an amplitude range of 0.1 and 3 millimeters. So the ePremium is designed for test sieve analysis labs that rely on particle analysis results that are accurate and repeatable. In fact, the device's customizable amplitude allows particles ranging from 20 micron to 125 millimeters to be tested with ease. The ePremium uses a unique three-dimensional elliptical motion to test sample material accurately. To do so, a heavy-duty magnet, which is attached to a spring, is electrically charged to cause the spring to rapidly compress and decompress thousands of times. As a result, the sieve plate makes subtle vibrations, creating the one-of-a-kind 3D motion. This 3D motion takes the particles in the sieve stack and moves them in a flat plane while the sieve plate uses the micro vibrations of the spring to move the sieve stack up and down. These movements work together to more or less mimic the actions of the mechanical RX29 sieve shaker. Now when conducting a test sieve analysis with the ePremium, the machine's designed to pause several times throughout the sieving process. This helps ensure that the particles can settle on the mesh of the sieves and fall through the openings if they're larger than the particle. And I should note, because the ePremium allows the user to set the amplitude and set the pause intervals, you can really dial in the optimal sieving combination after a thorough end of sieving analysis is conducted. So, like the RX29 Pure, the RX29 ePremium is meant to be used with 8-inch sieves. With that being said, the EML315 is a secondary version that creates our test sieve analysis with the same 3D motion. However, it's designed to house 12-inch sieves and is only available in premium or premium remote models. The 29E Premium also allows for the use of nine full-height sieves in a pan or 15 half-height sieves in a pan. The EML315 Premium allows for the use of seven full-height sieves in a pan or 13 half-height sieves in a pan. Also, regardless of the size of your sieve stack, you'll need to use a collection pan, but the cover of the device will fit over the sieve stack, which eliminates the need for a separate sieve cover. There's very little setup required to get your ePremium up and running. When you first take your device out of the box, you'll want to place it on a secure surface, like any other sieve shaker device. Next, you'll want to take the guide rods and screw them into their designated pilot holes. It's critical that you use the included wrench to secure these guide rods, since they're responsible for supporting the sieve stack during operation. You'll then need to secure the clamps onto the guide rods, pulling the gray elements to adjust their position as needed. Once this is complete, you can then place your sieve stack, securing the device cover onto the stack, and screw down the clamps. After ensuring the cover is fitted snugly over the sieve stack, you can adjust your amplitude and begin testing. The ePremium uses minimal wear parts. As a result, there isn't a lot of maintenance required to maintain your device. But no matter what Rotap E device you choose to implement, the guide rods should be kept free of dirt, dust, and other debris from previous tests. You can use a wire brush to remove any particles there. Keeping the rods clean will help ensure that the clamps can adequately grip the guide rods and secure the sieve stack. That said, if you encounter a situation where your device is running harder than it should, you'll need to send the device in for recalibration or minimal repairs. This also includes if your device is producing an unusual clicking noise. These are often indicators that the accelerometer is bad and must be replaced. If you're looking to invest in a Rotap RX29e Premium Electromagnetic Sieve Shaker, you can expect to pay approximately $6,800. But this price only reflects the device itself and does not include any additional test sieves that you may need. 
When working with mechanical sieve shakers, we recommend using a sound enclosure kit to dampen the noise created by the hammer tapping motion. Since the Rotappy devices don't utilize this hammer, they're much quieter and eliminate the need for a sound enclosure kit, as well as the expenses associated with it. Thanks so much for watching. If you have any questions or would like to request a quote, fill out our contact us form so we can answer your specific questions. Just click the link in the description. And if you want to learn more about Woven Wire Mesh or any of our many products, we have a learning center filled with written and video content to make you an expert. Just click the second link and you'll be that expert in no time. And don't forget to click the subscribe button and ring that bell to keep up with all things WS Tyler. Once again, I'm Candice and I'll see you around in the next video. Bye for now.